Hi everybody. The Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 is the spin-off of the 2020 liter tablet from Lenovo. The Gen 2 is somewhat of a hodgepodge, as it redesigns a couple of elements over the past model however at that point likewise leaves a few others on the hacking load up. First of all, the Gen 2 has a fresher and quicker Mediatek Companio 1300T chipset that replaces the past Qualcomm Snapdragon 730G, a 120Hz presentation, and you can now design the memory up to 8GB Smash and 256GB stockpiling. Then again, the new model has plastic development rather than aluminum, comes up short on super wide camera on the back and a unique mark sensor, has a battery that is 400 mAh more modest, and a showcase that is likewise a smidgen more modest with a somewhat lower goal. The model we have for survey today is the first in class model with 8 256 GB memory and accompanies the 2 in 1 console and accuracy pen 3 pointer in the container. This promises to transform the Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 into an undeniable work machine in a hurry. The Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 has a somewhat spotless and satisfying plan that is stylishly like its ancestor. Our model was designed with the 2-in-1 console, which is a two-section frill that incorporates the console and a back cover. console joins to the foundation of the tablet utilizing magnets and interfaces utilizing an actual connector, so it works in any event, when Bluetooth is impaired. The trackpad is a piece on the more modest side yet functions admirably, with great following and broad signal help that takes into consideration an extensive variety of usefulness being open through swiping movements. Utilizing the gadget on the lap isn't especially comfortable except if you have extremely lengthy legs that can oblige the edge of the pivoted fold on the back. In any case, there is an undeniable danger of the presentation simply tumbling off and hauling the console with it, something that can't occur with the conventional PC. Show. The Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 has a 11.2 inch, 2560x1536 goal, 120Hz OLED show. The showcase goal is somewhat lower than the 2560x1600 board on the Gen 1 model yet the 120Hz invigorate rate is new. The gadget additionally upholds Dolby Vision and HDR10 Plus and DCI-P3 inclusion. The showcase quality is great, with a wide variety reach and great splendor. The showcase is set up a wide range of wrong out of the container yet can be immediately set to standard sRGB variety reach and white point by changing to the standard mode through settings. The 120Hz invigorate rate improves things greatly while web perusing or messing around that help it. There is a touch of distorting while at the same time looking over while involving the tablet in picture mode as the presentation is wired to be utilized in scene mode however it's not effectively perceptible. The showcase has two issues, one of which is in programming and can be handily fixed. While the presentation has great execution while review Dolby Vision and the generally scant HDR10 Plus content, HDR10 was broken during our testing in the ongoing firmware. Programming The Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 sudden spikes in demand for Android 12 out of the crate. Lenovo has promised help up to Android 14 however we are yet to get any data on when Android 13 would show up. This doesn't leave us with a great deal of certainty on convenient future programming refreshes from Lenovo. The product experience on the Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 was for the most part like utilizing stock Android on a Pixel gadget however with a couple of added highlights. 
Few applications actually don't uphold a proper tablet mode for their UI and the not many that really do frequently don't utilize it. Obviously, absolutely no part of this is Lenovo's shortcoming however it is as yet the truth and something you should know about if you have any desire to get an Android tablet, particularly to use as a shoddy PC. Lenovo has incorporated a couple of increases that attempt to make the entire tablet as a PC experience a piece better. To involve a tablet for work, the iPad actually offers the best insight because of an endlessly better application environment and iPad OS simply being an undeniably more experienced and thoroughly examined working framework. Execution the Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 accompanies the new Mediatek Companio 1300T chipset, which incorporates a Quad Center Central processor and the Mali G77MC9 GPU. The presentation on our survey unit with 8GB memory and 256GB stockpiling was good. Involving the gadget as a productivity tablet was a seriously decent encounter, as things like web perusing, messages, dealing with records, picture altering, and video conferencing were a breeze. Media utilization is something else the gadget is great at, with extraordinary execution even while observing high goal 4K 60fps HDR recordings encoded in AV1. What the Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 isn't particularly great at is gaming. Since we are on the subject of media, the four speakers in each corner take care of business very well. Indeed, even without viable substance, the speakers offer great volume and sound quality. By the way, we needed to take note of the Wi-Fi, what while working fine when associated, found opportunity to interface with the switch after the gadget was booted up. Camera the Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 has an all-around bare-bones camera arrangement, more so than the past generation model. The two cameras are of normal quality, as would be considered normal of a mid-range tablet. End. The Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 is an exceptionally slim and light tablet with extremely decent presentation and speakers that makes it ideal for media utilization. The discretionary console and pen likewise perform quite well however can knock up the expense of the gadget impressively. The exhibition from the Mediatek Companio chipset is very great. Lenovo's product experience is likewise extremely perfect and easy to use. The gadget, notwithstanding, makes many concessions over its ancestors, which leaves it feeling notably more awful. Assuming the Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 was an inside and out exceptional tablet then perhaps there would be some case for it, however it isn't the case we would suggest considering the base iPad all things being equal. The Lenovo Tab P11 Pro Gen 2 checks out provided that your goal is absolutely media utilization. Pros Thin and light Good display quality Great set of stereo speakers. Clean software. Good performance for productivity and media consumption. Optional keyboard and pen work well. Cons. No fingerprint sensor, plastic body, and smaller battery than predecessor. Display viewing angles could be better. Android tablet experience is still lackluster. 4 GB RAM on the Thank base model is too low in 2023. Leave a comment below and let us know what you thought of the video. We'll see you in the next one.